Wow, I didn't remember this embankment so empty. I'm sure you can see that there are almost no people. There are only we. Sanya, me and Grisha. And we came here today because Sanya is going to ride a subsurf. He's going to meet the sunrise with the dolphins on the subsurf. And it's the beginning of our final day here, so with your strengths, welcome back to our vlog. Держи, Саня! Давай, плыви отсюда! Oh, I can have some time to relax because Sunny is there swimming on his subsurf with bananas and skeletons with a coach. There is such an absolutely empty beach without people, without any noise, you know, such a relaxing atmosphere. I think it's a great idea to come here in the morning. And Grisha is sleeping there. He's strong. Oh, Frank is beginning. Oh, I'm so sleepy too. I wish I could sleep. I think that after this vacation, I will need at least two weeks of vacation. It's so our final day here, I've already told you about this, and today at 21 p.m. we are going to leave, our train goes from the station at 21, and we need to leave our hotel room at 12, so the rest of the day we will have to spend somewhere, I, I think that we are going to do it at the territory of the hotel. The children are going to bathe in the swimming pool and I'm going just to sit in the shadows and do nothing. We also need to go to the supermarket to buy something for us for our trip because tomorrow we are going to be at home only at 23 or so. It was an amazing but a very hard trip and when we return back home we are going to prepare for the school year and start the school year in several days so it will be you know such a period of hard work for the children and for me and even Grisha will have to be with us and work hard so I, I do not feel that I managed to relax here it is obvious but I hope that the children did Oh, I can see even a group of people on subsurfs. Are they going to join my son? But he he has such a, an amazing individual trip for him with the coach. I think that such an experience it's going to be unforgettable for him. I'm sure that not many people have ever experienced something like this.
Сейчас пойдем греться чай горячий. Ты что, я тебе заеду на вторым полотенцем давай. Ты под конец падал, что ли? Да, ты верно. А всего мы почти тоже Привет. Привет. Покажи мне свои супер чипсы. Пойдем. We wanted to buy some coffee, but it's so strange that all the coffee shops or how are this place is called cafes where you can buy coffee and just such small, small you know, points where you can buy coffee. They are all closed and work. Since 8 a.m. I think that it's too late because people here can walk very early. Будь здоров, Григош. We have come to the beach. I can't say that it's the last time because we are going to return back here I'm sure that we will or we even want to do it next year but it's the final time for this trip Look how clean the water is. You can see and count all the stones. I mean, it's playing here, but you can see the situation of the beach. It is horrible. There are so many people. The beach is so crowded. The situation is the same every day. It's the end of August 2021. And all the people who didn't manage to go to Turkey or somewhere else, they came here. You can also see some people with babies. It's funny to see them somewhere there. So I leave Nina with Grisha and Sanya with our belongings and I'm going to go and give away the keys of our hotel room. Every time when our vacation is over I always feel so sad and gloomy and do not want to leave this place and return back home, but not this time. <laughs> Guys, I want to be sincere with you, I'm extremely tired and I really want to return back home. I do not tell this to my children because I do not want to disappoint them and I do not want to sp spoil their vacations. Uh, there are some people listening to music. Yesterday they were listening to Rammstein. Well, <laughs> this time 
I want, I dream to return back home, to lie on my bed and to feel free. And I have only several days left before the school year begins and I won't be free again. This is our place for several hours. Do you see? We found such a funny baby doll. <laughs> and only our stroller looks insane. Like, you know, a gypsy carriage. <laughs> There are so many babies here, we are sitting in the shadows in front of the pool and we are going to spend some time here because we went to leave our luggage at the reception, all this, and there was such a huge enormous queue there, just crazy, so many people, the tail, we call it the tail of this queue, it was standing right near the doors. It was just like this, you know, like a snake. And we didn't want to spend our time standing in that queue, so we decided to spend some time sitting in front of the pool. I hope that Grisha could sleep for some time, but no, he's awake. is now playing. When he gets tired of playing with these toys, I'm going to take him to the pool. Today I took him to the sea again. He played in the sea several times and I take him every day to the pool because he likes swimming there a lot and it's easier for, for him to swim there. He's not scared and the water is warmer. There is a tiny kitty sleeping there. This is my lunch for today. And frankly speaking, it's not tasty at all. But I do not know why. I'm not even hungry, even though I'm rather tired. Maybe uh, the reason is that when I'm nervous, when I'm in a hurry, I'm never hungry. It is already half past two. There is a kitty here lying on the grass. And there are Grisha and Sanya. Grishutka! Grishutka! Grishutka, малышutka! And Sanya. Sanya is trying to order a delivery of food for us. Grishutka! Grishutka! I have changed our place and came to another pool. As I've already mentioned, there are five pools here. You can choose the one you like. It is much cooler here, and rather windy. We ordered food delivery for the train. Chips. Dash Iraq. Clear noodles, fast food. You need to add some hot water. Bananas, chips, choco pies, and chips. My children like to take unhealthy food to the train. Anyway, we can't take any healthy food because it is rather hot, it can get spoiled, and we have no place where to cook it. So we just took all this stuff. We wanted to go to McDonald's. And it is in five kilometers from here. Oh my god. Uh, we made Grisha sleep, but then he woke up. We also wanted to leave our luggage in this building. There is a special room for your luggage. When you come here or when you leave the hotel, but you are not going to go away from the territory yet. But it is, it is full. <laughs> Finally, there is no space for our luggage. I've already told you about the queue there, and the queue has left all the luggage that those people had, and there is no place for our luggage. We were sent to the parking zone somewhere there, 
but our luggage is heavy. It is mo even more more heavy than than it used to be. And for speaking, we are just not ready to go and search for that place. And we also wanted to go to McDonald's, as I told you some time ago. But there is even no McDonald's delivery here to this place, to this hotel, and to this part of. So we ordered Dodo Pizza, our favorite pizza. Uh, I can say that the prices here are much higher than in Volgorod. In all restaurants, even those ones that we have there in Volgorod. The prices here are higher, the prices in the supermarkets are much higher and the, the prices in all the restaurants, in the same restaurants are higher. We wanted to order something from... Oh, is it my pizza? We are like a big gypsy family with children <laughs> and so on. There are also some people sitting with their luggage. It seems that everyone has decided to leave the hotel today. It's not surprising because it is the last weekend of summer and everyone is returning back to work, to schools, to universities. So, and it seems to me that the hotel even can't cope with all this. It is 18.30, there are about 40 minutes left and the pool is going to be finally closed. Some days ago the pools used to work till 20 p.m. And now they work till 19 p.m. till 7 p.m. But it's better for me. <laughs> Otherwise they could stay here till the end. And they wish to stay, to stay here till the end. And the lifeguards soon are going to send away all the children and other swimmers from the pool. <laughs> Sanya and Nina were the last to leave the swimming pool and the lifeguard even asked them twice to do it. We are ready to leave this hotel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they were, play <laughs> they were playing so well <gasps> together. Sanka, <laughs> <laughs> Sanka. We are ready to leave this hotel and this city. Hotel? <laughs> Sunny and Nina drinking hot chocolate with milk at the station Olympic Park. The boarding for our train hasn't started yet. The kids remember how they visited this railway station already. There are kids zones here, playgrounds. So, so nice. There are special playgrounds for the children. And I remember that there, there is even a TV set with cartoons and with Nishariki. And now my children see playgrounds and they are bored. No matter how old they are, they can play. You can see that it's such a huge railway station. 
Russian Railways. The way to win. Российские железные дороги, путь к победе. So nice. Гриш is finally asleep. We all got tired of him. And the next train is going to be our train. Olympic Park, the Olympic Park. There are some plants there, so beautiful. I'd like to show you everything a bit closer, but unfortunately, I can't get down because Grisha is asleep and he's in his stroller there, and I don't want to run from one floor to another with this tall I'm so tired already and my arms ache because of heavy mm, heavy bags my lovely babies just like Grisha sometimes I see them and think that they are already so big so mature so adult and sometimes I see that they are still my babies. By the way, every time when I'm asked how could I even decide to go on such a trip far away from home, alone, with three children, with Grisha, who is now only three months old, I answer that I have amazing elder children and that they are just like grown-ups and they decided to go with me and to help me and that I can rely on them and I'm not scared with them Vokzal Rashi, the railway stations of Russia I love the Olympic Park 